In this series we have discussed the near 40 year evolution and history of the TMNT, but now we turn to the evolution of the characters' voices. In this instalment I'll take a look at the voice of Michelangelo. Originally voiced by Townsend Coleman throughout the original series, Mikey has found himself voiced by different artists in almost every iteration of the franchise. Notable performers who've taken the mantle over the years include Wayne Grayson, Greg Sipes, Noel Fisher, Brandon Michael Smith and Seamus. Brown Jr. In this video we will explore all of the voice artists who have brought Mikey to life in major productions, including TV series and specials, films and select video games. Without further comment, I will allow the voice artists to guide you through Michelangelo Turtles voice evolution in this companion edition of Cartoon Evolution. <laughs> where we can get some pizza! Cowabunga! Yeah, don't sweat it, dudes! These chucks will take care of this walking glue factory! Alright! Finally! Cowabunga! It's pizza! Or at least it will be when it grows up. Total bummer! We're all gonna be turtle waxed! Cowabunga! For sure, dude! Four of us will take care of that clone of yours. No problemo. That's right, amigo. He's just a micro dude. Whoa, that is one ugly dude. Dudes, chill. We gotta fight the bad guys, remember? Sounds like he's the one who should disappear. Don't have to, dude. I already bought an RTD monthly pass. Radical dudes. We just walked into the world's biggest video game. Totally radical. You're just, just like, like me, me, dude. dude. Come on, go. Go. Crying's like trying to destroy both our realities, dudes. We just don't know how. You gotta believe us. I got this, dudes. Cowabunga! Dude, what is that? Whoa, this place is totally radical. Whoa, dudes, and besides, the toys you get to play with are twice as fun as any weapon you could use. And if you don't believe me, check out this next song. These instruments are amazing. So that's what we're doing here, dudes. We're bringing our music to all who will listen. And what do you think the first song we wrote was? That's right. It's about the one thing that really gets us going. And I mean no anchovies. You put anchovies on this thing and you're in big trouble, okay? Uh, uh, that'll do. And the clock's ticking, dude. <laughs> She's a babe. She called me Mikey. The only thing safe in the world would be the trees. <sighs> we'll find a home soon, Paulina. And then it'll be just you and me. Now, guys, guys, guys! I just got an idea. Two words that could solve all our housing problems. Timeshare. Oh. Goodies! <laughs> Later. Uh, Kenjin switched with April and got her clothes. So, this is for whoever comes through in my place. So they won't arrive bare butt naked. Well, uh, uh, it's a kappa kind of thing. So, uh, what's your sign? No problemo, dude. Just a little paper, some tape, pizza cake. Oh, pizza. Speaking of pizza, Splinter, no way, Jose. Like, Splinter was not on my list. Well, dude, like, pizza's on its way. And now it's time for one of my all-time favorite Christmas songs. And you kids can sing along. Grab a slice, let's kick it. We're gonna need some help. Let's call the kids and have them meet us in the park. And you kids can come along too, cause we're gonna need all the help we can get. How hey, 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 yeah. dudes? It's hard to believe, but like, the show is almost over. We've only got time for one more video. But you know what they say, yeah. leave the best for last. Oi, Karina, Hey Donnie, come watch Leo turn his noodle into strudel. <laughs> oh yeah, sewer surfing is all about safety. You kidding? That money's more mine than Silver's. I mean, he stole the ticket. I just found it. Maybe Don's right. You guys just don't understand the power of media, like I do. Hmm, yeah. <laughs> and who can forget the time that she kicked all our shells? <laughs> As for me, 
I never doubted your existence for a minute, Miss Yellow Ranger. But we could sure use a lift to New York. Whoa! Earthquake! Hey! How you doing? Hey, so, can I keep her? <laughs> I just love those action movie lines. You write those yourself. Don't be scared, bro. Jungle Girl will protect you. I've been wondering, why did battling Bernice quit the team for a year? It's okay, Sensei. We know the score. Clock's ticking, bros. Catch me if you can. <laughs> the dream's in Japan, right? Well, this is New York City. So it's all good, right? Right? Huh? Stop. I'm choking up. Uh... Happy birthday to me. <laughs> Our little alien Utram is back. This dimension is seriously messed up. This is the lamest vehicle in the history of lame vehicles. Can't this thing go any faster? Ah! Yeah. Shouldn't we be, like, non-existent right about now? Like, there she blasted! Yep. There's no place like home. Then maybe it's time we bust out two of our baddest rides. Easier just to show you, dude. Uh, dudes? Like, what just happened? Trying to steal our act. So you're supposed to be us from other worlds. I don't see it. Why skate a half pipe when you can skate a sewer pipe? Up next, I remember how they used to feel busting up crime syndicates. Sure, they had a bunch of guns, but they weren't like these guns. <laughs> Why'd you do this? I heard his bike turns into a plane or like a jetpack. Be done. You're so smart. Why don't we have jetpacks? Yeah. Okay, just a little bit creepy. <laughs> oh, gross. I think he did my nah, my nah, my nah. <laughs> I could be anywhere. <laughs> How do you stop what you can't even see? You're not listening to me. Did you just slap me? Why would that calm me down? Just, just come here. I'm telling you, the big guy was a robot and he had a freaky weird alien brain thing in his chest. Ooh, watch me now. Flip, flip, bing, bing, zap. Ha <laughs> yeah. You see that? New high score, dudes. Uh. Rap! He's been gone for hours. Rap! He's all leafy and weird looking. Like a salad. Ooh, pizza. Aw, <laughs> oh, man. So hungry. Ooh, what's this? Hmm. Whoa! Ah! Face my He could barely take down three cultists. How are we gonna take down an army plus Tiger Claw and Hothead too? This place isn't creepy. Nope, not at all. Uh-uh. <laughs> not in the slightest. Ah! Oh, I wanted to be able to fly and read minds. Can we get a pizza on the way? I'm starving. And there were brains all over the place. It was terrible. Oh, and then Shredder started throwing rocks at everyone. No, 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 whoa, whoa, chill. It's just a mask. See? Don't freak out. Right? Oh, and we're teenagers. But we can still have adult conversations. Who we'll find you, O'Neal? I'm sorry, that came across super creepy, okay? That's... <laughs> we will find you, though. We left the lair because the foot were taking hostages and we kicked some serious butt and there was this girl named April O'Neil who took our picture. But we took care of it. Fellas, fellas, now the people in New York need us to set aside our differences and work together. Whoa, they've achieved the power of flight. Good for them, you know? I don't know, like a mustache maybe, evil goatee or something, you know what I'm saying? Ah! It's like a chewed up piece of gum with a face. All right, make it in rain. Ha! Four score and 20 more tickets. How could you turn on your brothers, D? Wrestling's about the fans, the pageantry, the thick scent of sweat in the air, not the violence. Typical overprotective rap, worried about nothing. Uh, what, just a little case of jelly bone? I'll be fine. You know, according to my calculations, as long as you believe in yourself, you can do anything. Oh, man. That thing must be dangerous if the Foot Clan wants it. Rap! What happened to our powers? In case you didn't notice, we were getting our butts kicked. It's a sword, Brella, too? I think I love this little guy. I was protecting the citizens, man. The citizens! Pretty cool. This is amazing. I don't know what to put my grubby paws on first. Come on, dude. You can't fight crime without first partaking in a cheesy slice. This isn't the time for pizza. 
totally don't understand that sentence. Um, Guy right. Fieri seems like a fun hang, and I've always wanted to go to Flavortown. Look, human woman, I got a question. So, just be straight with me. Do you think there are more people like you? You know, people who will accept us? I want more, guys. I got the taste of life, and I don't want to wash out of my mouth. I want it to linger on my tongue, swish around my throat, and... You're... It's impossible. We need, like, a long and narrow device that's small enough to get under the seat, but strong enough to press the pedal. <laughs>